Hi guys, welcome. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. To those who've already been here, welcome back. To those who are new here, welcome. My name is Pierce Adams and this is my YouTube channel. So, this is going to be a really short video, I think. I believe, because it's not a really long story. But, this video is a story time about when I ran away from my house. So, this is my first, this is actually my first story time. Yeah, this is my first story time. So, short video story time when i ran away from home that's it before i go into that i wanted to like explain how my car diaries work so car diaries mainly has to so car diaries mainly has to do with me in a car videoing whether vlogging or whatever but the idea behind it is I get good natural light and yeah I get good natural light so I just thought why not make it a thing so this is good light so every video that you see me in a car is a car diary it could be me just vlogging talking with a friend or me just like you know doing what I gotta do so this video is a story time so this is car diary episode 2 currently I'm waiting for my sister she's inside doing you know her own thing but yeah so let's get back into the video so in my hand is my milkshake from y'all hey smoothie from y'all yeah so let's begin so i was about 12 to 13 years right and i like this guy i was with this guy oh i liked him whatever i want to call him i was with this guy and his name does because he doesn't really play a major role so i was with this guy and they were together and you know we decided to meet up at legacy i'm sure like a lot of people know <laughs> that didn't sound if you hear me you know if you hear i'm not speaking like a Ghanaian, it's because i believe god is just preparing me for the outside world so it's not intentional yeah so you know sometimes it may just you know far inside but yeah so i like this guy we decided to meet some legacy i'm sure a lot of people know what legacy is you know it was a party moment like in jh's legacy ha it was always in july like the ending of july that was legacy time so we decided to go for legacy right and the house i come from when we're younger if you're going to this place everybody has to go so in order for me to go i had to convince my brothers to convince my mother so that we all go family time bonding time so yeah that's it so yeah we got to legacy i made it the convincing and everything worked i got to legacy and i was waiting for this guy because i had to like we tried to meet them and we all know legacy has this bang and dance where you know you go and dance and shake your body shake shake and all of that the car was moving on but yeah legacy has all of that all of that so it was time for the dance hall right and i went there and i did a few dances and everything right i did a few dance <laughs> few dance moves for my fans you know because yeah some few dance moves for my fans not dance moves, you, know, you get me so i went there i danced a bit with some friends some people and everything and everything and then i finally saw my guy was to dance you know i felt it in my being that yeah yeah so fast forward to like later on and then um i i, just, I don't know what happened and i think my brothers were looking for me because it was time for us to go home and then before i left somebody was like i'm going to tell your mother you were dancing with boys and who is you're dancing with boys and they were having sex there and they were smoking and all of that and all of that and all of that hey my mother 
going to tell my mother i do this is what i was doing at my young tender age are you mad i was like oh i tried begging the person actually but the person was like mm -mm, lie lie i'm telling your mother on the whole ride i was quiet because in my head i was thinking what am i going to do what am i going to tell what am i going to say? what am i going to do because my mother will beat me and <sighs> what do i do what like what at all do i do because this person is really coming to ruin my life sorry if i'm looking this person is coming to ruin my life like what did i ever do to you like why <laughs> Hmm. so i got to no so before i got to it was in my head I ran away now before we move on let me just say this now before that i had plans of running away because i thought life was a nigerian movie my escape plan or what i thought would happen as i'm escaping is as i am walking down the street or i'm going to see a rich person who will stop me and say oh dear sorry <laughs> i'll find a rich person who'll stop me and be like oh dear like are you lost are you missing do you need somewhere to stay and the person will adopt me and yeah just like that instant new family and my specifications were the person has to be rich like i must have been no broke person <laughs> my plan was to get somebody who was rich period like that's it so i got home and obviously i couldn't just run away like that so the plan so when i got home when i go home how am i moving like <laughs> when i got home then i what did i do hmm. Mm -hmm. i got home and then i i was home for like a few minutes i made everybody like see my face you know like so i do not notice what i'm missing so everybody saw my face you know when i realized that like, mm, this is the time i got up i had this really cute heart shaped bag right it was so cute it was a nude some a shade of nude bag and it was like long strap and it was a heart that was the bag i had so it was me and my cute heart shaped bag in my jeans and in my top and i don't know if i was wearing sandals but whatever i was wearing and i I just walk gently, quietly, 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 quietly. <laughs> anyway, so it was me. I walked quietly, 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 and then I got to the door. No, so wait. Get to the door. I got to the main gate. See, yeah. I got to the main gate. When I got there, see, <laughs> I started running. Literally, I started. You say both didn't have anything on me that day, but then again, I wasn't really that fast because as soon as I like, started, one of my neighbors stopped me and was like, Hi, how are you? And then I was like, Bro, that's not the time to talk to me. I'm on a mission to find a rich family, but already, not like my parents are. Unless my parents are broke, if you, you know, think that's on me, I'm on a mission to find a family to adopt me and take me in and just make me, you know different like that's what i wanted so you're wasting my time you don't know where my savior could be at the moment all this time we're talking right now my man or my woman could be rolling in her bands or something and just looking looking out for anybody running again i was a stupid child because i was just stupid that's very harsh of me to say i was a very silly immature girl in her thinking proud on me for you know dealing with it that way yeah i was a small girl you know so i was like okay so i spoke to him first i think he even asked me guys i think he even asked me where i was going i was like i'm running away or something i don't remember but i think i said something silly like that but that just by the way so yeah after my guy and i stopped you know having a conversation i started running again run 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 running again i didn't end up anywhere <laughs> i ended up at my friend's mother's place my friend was there so my friend was like so much like hey like i told her like this and this i did not tell her the full thing i just told her like another thing that's like tmi if i say it 
and she was so she went to her mother her mother was like oh i should just go home you know you know adults have this way of making you sometimes you know go back basically they made the other adults look good so i was just like okay so i was like okay so i went back home mad and funny enough yeah, my mom normally comes on like later in the evening she comes on like nine thereabouts but the woman said she'll call my mom and talk to her for me so that you know no beatings nothing everything will be cool so i was like okay if you say so i'm going back home i went back home guys i went back home ha 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 and that day i don't know what happened my mom came home early she wasn't it wasn't even like eight, like maybe six seven eight she came home like five five or four four or five and by the time i had reached the house after my slight escape <laughs> this mom was already waiting for me she had already been told that her daughter was you know being a hoe or whatever i was smoking i was doing this and this she had already told my mother already told my mother <laughs> so yeah i tell my mother she gets some now this is the part i don't remember but what i do remember is i was beaten ha ah, i was beaten really really beaten it's no joke i was really beaten she really beat me hey <laughs> now you may think this story has a meaning i'm going to give some advice i don't think so baby don't run away from him i know i can't also say that but all i will say is nothing there's nothing to actually say like that would make anything feel better but yeah oh yes 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 mind your business mind your business why are you going to tell my mother this and why can't you mind like <clears throat> people like that really piss me off mind your business mind your mind your business you should stop it like you don't know how people's families react to some things like you don't know and you just open your mouth yappy 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 even if you feel it's you doing a good deed just mind your business that's it mind your business ah mind your business but yeah <laughs> sorry but yeah this is my short story about how i ran away from run away from home because i know you can reach 10 minutes away from my house i wasn't even 10, 10 minutes away and then i returned and yeah if we didn't die for that easy i'll be walking down the street walking, walking down the street and then some rich man will be like my daughter are you okay should i take you home with me but that's like some hansel and gretel kind of thing so that sounds just really weird but yeah guys so this is the end of my story time don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel I don't know if it's going to be short. Right now, I'm seeing it's 13 minutes here as I'm recording. But when I'm done editing, I don't know how long the short is going to be. But yeah, welcome. Hey. <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks so much also for all the views, all the comments, all the love, the support. I really appreciate it. Like, I really appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much. The feedbacks, especially. I love it. I love it thank you so much so yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe but yeah guys don't forget to like comment and oh also the gofundme the gofundme the gofundme every video contains a gofundme i'm going to try and be yeah i think it shouldn't be hard but if you want me to put your gofundme in my video you can text me privately yeah, you can text me privately if that's what you want but yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel guys thank you